here's what I've got now I mean I've always stacked it this way just between some fence post or up against a tree any old way nothing too high tech about it but we're gonna experiment and see if it's better uh, we'll do it in a circular way I'm gonna stack it right over here and we'll see what that looks like I don't like putting firewood directly on the ground because bugs and dirt and mud and everything is just going to rot it so fast. So I just had these little scraps of tin laying around so I used them. I mean anything would work. Take a little break. Oh, where'd he go? Let's see. Can you see him? Oh, I see him. Some tree frog, huh? Oh, there he went. Can we carefully get him out of there? There he is. Found this guy when we were stacking. Pretty lively. You could probably find a safer spot for him. Let's put him over here. There you go. Well, now he didn't want to get off. There we go. So that's what we ended up with. I definitely think it's it's more visually appealing than that. So I kind of have some takeaways, I guess. I I think it makes a huge difference. Obviously, how long your pieces of firewood are and how finely split they are. Mine are pretty coarse and irregular, so I end up with a lot of big gaps. You know, it's not as pretty and symmetrical as some I've seen. And I think that... So you can't pack it nearly as tightly. Maybe if I'd made a bigger circumference at the base, that might have helped with the size firewood I had. 
So there's a lot of dead air space or a lot of open air space, I guess is a better way to say it. So this would probably dry a lot faster than my other pile. And I guess that's good. And with all your irregular chunks, you can throw them in the middle where they're harder to put in a stack like that. So I can see there being more critters in this because there's so much more area to hide in it. I'm just going to tarp it at the top. So, all in all, I I like it. I may stack the rest of it this way. We'll see how the stack holds up and I'm sure a little practice and a little nicer split wood would make a big difference. So, anyway, uh, that's how it turned out. So, thanks for watching.